The Feldenkrais exercise is also known as Awareness Through Movement Lessons. It is useful for improving strength, conditioning, and flexibility of the back. Here we will demonstrate two methods. The first method is the tilting legs method. While laying on your back, bend both knees with feet flat on the floor. Tilt both knees a little bit to the left and then a little bit to the right. And then pause. A variation of this technique is to cross one knee over the other knee. If the right knee is crossed over the left knee, then tilt to the right and back to the center. And repeat. Then it can be repeated by crossing the left knee over the right knee, tilting to the left side, and back to the center. And repeat. Balance walking exercise can help maintain balance, prevent falls, and improve coordination. In older adults, these exercises can promote independence. Having support on one side, such as a chair, and a wall on the other side, walk with heel to toe, placing one foot in front of the other, nice and slow. Then slowly turn around and walk the other way. If you feel comfortable, try to walk without holding on to any support. And then slowly turn back around. Pilates-based exercise not only improves torso or core strength, but offers other benefits such as spinal and joint mobility, balance, and coordination. Older adults may benefit from Pilates-based exercises to help improve and maintain mobility. Heel slide exercise is used in Pilates to work on correcting posture during physical activity and has been shown to improve postural stability. Here we will demonstrate the most common version. First, lie down supine with the knees bent and arms at the sides. Draw the navel inward so that the abdominal muscles are contracted and the lower back is pressed into the mat. Pull the shoulder blades back and down and the back of the head placed against the mat. Then slowly slide the right foot out while keeping the abdomen contracted and pause for a second. Bring the leg back up to starting position. Then slowly slide the left foot out while keeping the abdomen contracted. Bring it back up and repeat 10 to 15 times on both sides. Once you have good control of the exercise, perform with both legs at the same time. And while doing this exercise, remember to inhale through the nose and exhale through the mouth. The single leg stance strengthens the muscles and joints of the leg, improves balance, and prevents falls. To do this technique, stand between two firm chairs or the kitchen counter on one side and a wall on the other side. The hands will be kept above the chairs should you need to hold on for support. With the knee slightly bent, stand on one leg and bring the other foot forward, out to the side, and straight back. Then repeat, forward, out to the side, and straight back. Then repeat this exercise on the other leg. Forward, out to the side, straight back. Forward, out to the side, straight back.